Hello family members and today you're welcome to another edition of the Ken Stevens Hold Hands Movement. I know it's been a while I did something for you so I'm back again for a very special tutorial today. It's a great effect I did it on my recent video um, Boy Tag New York City. The link of the video is going to be on the description box below. Um, let me just play the video for you so you can have a clue on what we're about to do today. So it's gonna be like this. Um Drop this money, money, money up. Boy tag, tous les femmes sont belles. La mignon si t'es ne se voit pas que au lit. Ne peut vous être joli. Si quelqu'un vous dit le contraire, c'est la folie. Attachez vos ceintures et soyez prêts pour le bonheur. Tant que c'est réveil, faut t'exprimer bébé. Le même, le même si tu pégayes. So that's it. So. It's a very simple tutorial. A lot of people will be asking me if I did it in After Effects and the answer to that question is no. <laughs> it's a no. I didn't do it in After Effects. I did it in Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2017. So it's a very simple effect. You can just follow along and I believe after this you'll be able to do yours. So um, firstly, I want to give a big shout out to Dissolve. I actually... Um, got inspired by this dissolve video when I, I saw it on facebook so it's just about um this pan shift effect something so when i saw it i was really inspired and, and i said to myself i need to do this in my video <laughs> so it's just very simple so thank you dissolve for inspiring me <laughs> i appreciate okay so let's head to work um, so I'm just going to create my sequence. The first thing I want to do is I want to select the portions in which I will make the effect in. So um, this is where I'll start. See? So I'm going to start here and, and right here. So I'm going to pull it. i take it down to my timeline. Keep existing effect. And right over to the next video I'll transit to. I will just that right where the artist comes in then i will just end whenever i want to end so <clears throat> so right now i have two videos firstly i want to make this um point uh, i shot this video on sony a7s mark ii on i shot it in 4k so you can see this is a 1080 timeline that's why the video is zoomed out so i can just scale down to frame size so just go to frame size so i can get the normal size of the image doing this effect is going to help you if you shoot in 4k okay so i'll just start with the effect so the next thing i'm going to do is make sure that right where boy tags leg is out of the frame like half of the body is out of the frame um, i want to make sure on this top layer boy tags leg it's into the frame the first leg gets into the frame so something like this let me just zoom in something like this like half of the body gets into the frame something like that if i take down the opacity of the top layer you're going to see what happens so it's going to be like this you see so it's going to be like that so the next thing i want to do is i want to make sure that i keyframe right where boy tags get into the next frame like this right here and i put a keyframe on the top layer too bottom and top layer too then i want to make sure that that this action happens right at the middle of your frame so how am i gonna do this uh i'll just take the bottom layer and i pull it right at the middle right there and i'll take this top layer and pull it right at the middle right here so you see it happens right at the middle it should happens right at the middle of your frame if you see what's happening right now you find out that uh, this image on on your right hand it's kind of small and the one on your left hand is kind of um, bigger i want to scale this up so it can match with this image on your left this is where um, when you have um, the 4k advantage because while scaling you won't lose um details i'm just gonna scale sorry i'm gonna scale the the top layer up I'm gonna scale the top layer up like this then i'm gonna push it to no i want it to match i want the legs to match with this the floor ground to match with this so i'll bring it down okay i might take it scale it down a little then i take it backward good 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 if you see the floor layer matches very well this is gonna be like this 
you see so that's it it happens right there okay so the next thing we're going to do is that this, as this one on the left goes behind the one on the right goes follows it a lot so i'm gonna push let's right here and i'll just shift the frame and then this one is gonna follow i want to make sure it matches correctly so So if you see what's happening here, it's going to be like this. That's it. Very simple. I want to make sure it starts where my video fills the frame. So I'm going to just reset this. So it's going to be like this. And it comes in. So now I want to make sure that this footage right at the top follows the footage right at the bottom while it pans like this. So I'm going to pull this one. Then right here I'm going to make sure this top layer comes right at the top here so it's gonna if i play it it's gonna be like this very simple very simple like that just like that just like that when i move you move yeah right here now i can just decide to and along to make sure I don't lose her in the frame so it's just gonna be like that she's walking and I'm panning so it's gonna look like I'm using a tripod and I'm panning with my tripod so it's a very simple effect so you can run along I think Boytak is a really crazy guy you know <laughs> So that's it guys i mean it's a very simple effect you just need to go out there get shots you know come into premiere just you know just follow along just do it i hope you've learned something from these little ideas um, um just go ahead and share the video to other filmmakers let them learn let's learn it's all about hold hands movement and subscribe for more videos go ahead watch the video the official video it's on the description box below just watch the video there are a lot of creative ideas inside you know you can just go ahead and ask questions i'm gonna answer you you can send questions on facebook you can just comment right over there you can send questions on instagram on twitter anywhere you find me just ask me questions and i'm gonna answer you with the video tutorial so once again it's king stevens hold hands movement and see you next time